Take a look at these wares. Only the finest goods here. See for yourself. Check out these wares. There's a guard under the wall. Let's have a chat. No, a colorful discussion. Aloy, what brings you to Meridian? A threat. The Eclipse will attack soon, from the west, with an army of ancient war machines. But that's not the worst of it. They'll bring a mind with them, god, demon, machine, whatever you want to call it. It's called Hades, and it doesn't want Meridian at all. It wants the Spire, and if it gets there, it will send out a call, waking more ancient machines, more than we could ever defeat. All will be lost. We can't let that happen. I'm trying to understand, but my responsibility lies with Meridian. Meridian isn't the target of Odd. You have to defend the Spire. Perhaps the Vanguard, your Radiance. Yes. Send them to the Spire. Aaron knows Aloy. He won't question it. And have the city guard fortify the western ridge. There they can be seen to protect Meridian and the Alight where the spire rests. Aloy. Allow me to apologize for my behavior before. After everything that happened with Ursa, I was confused. If we're to fight together on the brink of life and death, I'd prefer to do so with your forgiveness. Then you have it. As long as you don't confuse me with her again. Even a king can learn his lesson. Good then. I'm, I'm glad that's behind us. Now. It will take time to prepare our defenses. Please, tell me what you know of our enemies. Everything. I don't know about everything, but I'll tell you what I can. Have you spoken to Blameless Murad? Not yet, but I will. He wishes to speak to you. Defensive preparations are his responsibility. Quietly does it. Panic in the city will only create another enemy. 
and do keep me appraised of each new arrival. Ah, Aloy. Preparations are underway on the rigid defenses and at the spire. Word was sent to every corner of the Sundom. Our allies offered their steel. Some came for Meridian, others for Shards. But many came for you, by name. For me. Don't be so humble. The ridge will be the front line. That's where the city guard are holding? Yes, bolstered by some of the uh, irregulars I spoke of before. The Osaram cannons that thundered Meridian's walls in the Liberation will now defend us. You're welcome to tour the defenses. And the Spire. Erend and the Vanguard are there? Indeed. Uh, clashing breastplates together and testing out their battle cries, I suppose. A number of the Nora have also arrived at the Spire. They have resisted the offer of a royal audience. Perhaps you could parley with them. I will. I suppose all we can do is wait for the attack. Exactly. It's not a feeling I cherish, but our spotters at Evening Sign report there's still no movement in the West. So, if there's more you need to do elsewhere, seize this time to do it. Otherwise, I've made the apartment of Olin Delverson available to you. You can sleep there, if sleep comes. a moment to speak of the fire things. family might still be alive, and you're going to stand here and do nothing? We've lost a dozen patrols beyond the valley. Our orders are clear. No more. Freehold reward. You're talking about orders. I'm talking about lives. There wouldn't be Have you just left or polished that armor, is it? Of course. Uh, isn't that a little... What? Nothing. Out with it, woman. Forget I said anything. You look very dignified. Thank you. And shiny. Very shiny. Little Huntress, you called, so here I am. Ready to fight? Fight? I thought you just wanted tea and conversation. Is there a battle coming? I wasn't informed. Well, that can't be true. You're always informed. Ah, so I am. We've only met a few times, and yet you know me so well. I don't think I know you at all. But I'd like to. Hmm. When I hear that line, it usually means something else. Can I tell you a secret? Of course. I've been waiting for this fight my whole life. The enemy we face today is the same that turned Meridian into a slave pit and Sunfall into a bloodbath. Fanatics who torture and murder mothers, fathers, families, children, and say it's the will of the sun. I hate them, Aloy. I've got the scars of their whips on my back to prove it. And today, we can get rid of them once and for all. I said I came for you, but that was only half the truth. I came for them. This time, they're not getting away. I'm with you, Vanasha. We'll fight them together. And I won't forget it, little Huntress. Tomorrow, may the sun rise in a better world. Always stay bright. I only fight when I have to, but by the time I have to, I usually want to. The only justice Derval deserves. Aloy. Um, at ease, Uthid. 
Meridian will be glad to have you on its side. And I am too. The honor is mine. You saved my epitaph from being a fine soldier, but a fool of a man. I'm hoping you won't need any kind of epitaph just yet. As the sun wills. When you found me, I was trying to eke out a glorious death. But now, a glorious life seems more preferable. To watch Edelman play in the Low Gardens again. Still surrounded by a dozen guards, but... What you did, Aloy, it was done well. Although, I can't shake this road, Vinasha. She delights in goading me, like brazen colors waved before a behemoth. Do you want me to ask her to stop? No. I accept it. Well then, Meridian shall stand and shadow shall fall. I swear it. Here's to that, Uthid. Meridian. I couldn't imagine living anywhere else. Huh. So you must be Aloy, then. I thought there'd be more of you. More of me. Thicker, I suppose. More of a gear wheel, less of a ringlet. Don't get me wrong, you're very well struck. Do all Osirim flirt at the most inopportune times? Inopportune? Battle hasn't even started yet. Petra Forge Woman, I hail from the Free Heap. I'll be heading back in the next dust storm. Murad asked me to check over the city arsenal first. Cannons have aged well, but I've cleared their throats so they can really roar. Can I try one? Everybody wants a turn. Have at it, then. It hits nice and wide. No need to aim it like a bow. Range is good. Try the next. Do you think you'll kill in the yeah. battle, Lisa? It's from the battle of the dawn. As many as I have. Can be. Get aboard. Mill? Hey, Lord. They told me your name. I said hair like a splash of blood, tenacious as a scrapper's jaws. I've thought about what you said. Every time, the wound you gave me caught in my ropes. But I didn't wound you. Not by men. Still, I forgive. A duel is such a fleeting joy. If one of us had ended the other, we'd have missed all this. The weight of her blood is shed, like the scrape of a blade across your teeth. Nil, you're making it difficult to be glad to see you. But you're needed. The battle will be hard. Hard? I was assured the odds would be near impossible. And you signed up anyway? Impossible odds, fine company, killing without consequence. How could I resist? Well, I don't like to boast. I told you I'd be here. You did, Teb. But have your wounds even had time to heal? Honestly, if I fought, I'd probably come undone. But don't worry. I'll leave that to the other Nora at the Spire. I brought supplies instead. These Karja have made me an honorary quartermaster, whatever that means. <laughs> it sounds impressive. I could get used to it. We'll be setting up caches of arms and medicine under these banners. Look for them when the fighting starts. Aloy, when you went into the mountain, did the goddess tell you our chances? She didn't need to. I know we can do this, Teb. Maybe we can. That's a I nice feeling. The there wouldn't be anything you. left of this place. I like the way they grip it. Couldn't be different from the guard of the last king. 
Far Cry for little kids.
You're the hunter from the Banuk Grove. I remember you also, Nora. The machines shook free of their slumber after you arrived. Raged and fought. Uh, well, that, that wasn't my fault. No, I'm thanking you. That night I decided I would not go back to Banur. I would take my hunt into these lands. So many machines, even demons. Spidery, skittering, without the blue light in them. Dead things that must be killed again. Our enemies dug up an army of them. An army? Yes, that's why I came. Good. I'll wait. Taller than the highest tree. These cards are in their frilled armor look like turkeys. War Chief Sona. War Chief, you you seem uncomfortable. The Nora do not belong here. I do not belong here. I will fight the metal devil that threatens us all, but my place is in the sacred land. The wrongness here jags at me like an arrowhead. I'm sorry to put you through this. Do not be sorry. This will be ended. My spear, my word. The Karja do not impress me. To build so tall is to invite the fate of the ancients. Greetings, Aloy. Don't. You don't need to bow. The anointed doesn't like it. She doesn't much like being called anointed, either. It means a lot to have you here, Varl. I gave my word. So, Meridian, what do you think? I've seen... many new things since I first met you. I should thank you. Varl, what's wrong? You really want to know? All right. I'm in a foreign land, a tainted land, defending a faithless city that looks like nothing I've seen from something I can't imagine. And you, after all that's happened, all you've done, I feel like I should drop to my knees and worship you, but I know you don't want that. Boy, things are pretty tough for you, huh? Thanks for telling the other Nora not to bow. It's the last thing I need. <laughs> don't be too hard on them. They only joined this fight because the Anointed bid it so. Is that why you came? No. I would have come just to see you one more time. And we must fight a metal devil, because the goddess says, or because you say. I think the goddess and I are in agreement. We're both glad you're here. So am I. So who are these guys? They call themselves the Eclipse. What does that even mean? It's when the moon... Aloy. <laughs> so here we are again, gearing up for a fight. Only this time it sounds like the bad guys have a lot more firepower. What are we up against, really? I'm not sure. But there's gonna be a lot of them, and they'll have machines. And if they get past us, it's not just Meridian that will fall. The rest of the world will go with it. Well, that's... big. It sounds like our kind of fight. Right, guys? Well, where do they put the vanguard? At, At the, the front, front of the line! Iron. And what are we gonna do? Hit them like a hammer till they can't, can't hit, hit back. back! Damn right! You hear that? Nobody's getting past the vanguard. We're here for Meridian. 
And we're here for you. Thank you, Erend. Ursa would be proud. Well, only if we win. Roland's apartment feels empty. Should I sleep? Did I leave anything unfinished? Elizabeth, with a weight like this pressing on you. How did you rust after you lost your family? Silence? Are you there? I guess I shouldn't ask ghosts for advice. There are signs from the west. Sun King of Odd awaits you at the Temple of the Sun.
campfires, perhaps? Massing forces for the long march to the city gates? That's not real smoke. And what is it? The end. Or how it begins, anyway. you spoke of to the guns to the guns now by the sun do as she says <laughs> set loaded all of you be ready to fire will the guns hold them back Enforcements. Aloy, no! We need those guns! He will cut you down! Not this time! <laughs> you have vexed me long enough. Should have fought me in a sun ring then.
be wary. Chance to catch a breath and prepare.
Aloy. 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 Dad. By all mother, you survived. I thought you were killed. The others, are they? No, no, wounded, but alive, mostly. The machines blasted through, then kept going. They marched. Take care of the others, Teb. I've got to go. Son, shadow demons. This is where I belong, Aloy. Eh, the desire calls for you. It must have gotten through the defenses. Anora. Baron's vanguard. I have to get up there. It's Aloy! Well, you, you can see that. We thought you'd fallen at the ridge. No, the ridge fell on me. Look, there isn't a lot of time left. 
I have to face Hades. Not alone. My fight. I can't ask you to come with me. We we're about to go over the top anyway, right? Right. The metal devil must fall. I should stock up. Last chance.
time I've got left. I can do this. System threat imminent. I'm more than a threat. Master Override armed. To activate state name and rank. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Purging extinction protocol. Okay, Gaia. Uh, sorry about that. Where was I? You were telling a story. Right. Yeah, so, um, like I was saying, it was a children's electronics kit, but I hacked the wiring to an auto battery and solar PV. So the grass caught fire. And uh, so did a, a tall pine that had stood there, uh, I don't know, maybe a hundred years. Query. You were how old? Six. My mother was home, thank God, so she called the fire department and after she took me out to the lawn and showed me the dead baby birds because there were nests in the pine tree. Query, what did you feel? I'm not sure. I remember yelling that I didn't care and that's when my mother took my face in her hands and spoke. Query. What did she say? She said I had to care. She said, Elizabeth, being smart will count for nothing if you don't make the world better. You have to use your smarts to count for something. To serve life, not death. You often tell stories of your mother, but you are childless. I never had time. I guess it was for the best. If you had had a child, Elizabeth, 
What would you have wished for him or her? I guess I would have wanted her to be curious and willful, unstoppable even, but with enough compassion to heal the world just a little bit. That's all I've got for now, Gaia. Time to tuck in. I wish you a pleasant sleep, Elizabeth. Thank you. I'll catch you tomorrow.
Hello, old friend. Remember me? We've still so much to discuss. So much you never revealed. Your masters, for example. The ones who sent the signal that woke you. Knowledge has its rewards, don't you think? Well, let's begin. <laughs> 